Hello, and thanks for tuning in today. Uh, we are looking at the Bag Smarts version of a toiletry bag. Um, some people call it dop kit, some people call it wash bag, some people call it toiletry bag. Um, either way, um, the aim of this video, uh, which is part of my impression series, is to you know have a look at products um, and um, talk about my use case for them. So this is the box mat uh, toiletry bag. It comes in other colors, uh, like khaki or gray. Uh, what I got is the black color. And um, one of the reasons why I bought this one is because I have a couple of other dub kits and I will be doing um, a video on uh, the different form factors of dub kits and their use cases um, so it's very soon so that people can um, you know have a look at that and decide what dub kit that suits them for different travel reasons and also for you know different sort of um, you know items that they like to travel with some people like to travel minimal uh, some people like to pack a detailed set of toiletry when they are traveling so this one personally this will be for when i want to travel for a week or more than a week. It's quite a massive uh, toiletry bag. Um, and um, so I will talk about how I will use this. Capacity wise, uh, it's got quite a huge capacity. The actual bag is about 9.4 inches by 6.3 inches. And I think the thickness is about 4.6 inches. So it is it is uh, a big uh, dock kit um is not the type i will use on a min for minimal travel because it will occupy quite some space in your bag uh, so this is for when you want to travel for a few uh for more than a week yeah uh, this is ideally when i'll use this one so some of the features uh, of the bag is that it's designed to open up wide so it's got um it's got uh, a zipper and this is how you zip it up and it has a clip um, that pins it in um, and it's, it is magnetic and when you un want to unzip it you know it's quite an easy unzip and the design is that it opens up so that you have access to this whole main section where you can put away a few of your you know some of your toiletries also it comes with this section. One of my main attractions to this particular um, bag as well is the fact that it can hold an electric toothbrush. So I don't have to have uh, a travel carry for my electric toothbrush. My electric toothbrush can also fit into uh, this section. So everything is all self-contained and uh, you can you can go uh, the only challenge is I don't think this is waterproof uh, out from, you know, if liquid spills inside the bag uh, because of the closing mechanism, this section is not really sealed off. So if liquid spills inside the bag, there's a tendency that it will come out. But the actual bag itself is supposed to be water repellent. Uh, the zipper I don't know what sort of brand of zipper this is. So, uh, but the, t the you know the teeth of the zipper feels very sturdy. Um, you know, you can see the way it glides through without any problem. It is a double zipper, but uh, unfortunately, because it's all I think either aluminium or metal, um, it's all jingly. So something to to note. Um, there are several pockets in this particular wash bag so you have this section where you can this elastic section where you can pass through a couple of your uh, items if you've got a standard toothbrush you can pass that through here i would assume this is for electric toothbrush because this is a, a bigger um, elastic area 
Um, if you have blades, I believe you can pass this through. So those who, who use shaving sticks, um, that could also go through this section. This section itself has uh, a bit of a mesh, but it is waterproof as well. So this section, you can put away items that you feel probably has tendency of spilling and it will try to protect it as much as possible. Um, there is also a whole raft of elastic section here where you can put tubes or you know where you can put your you know items that are liquid as well so that will help hold it straight up um, so that they don't fall over and spill and you've got a couple of mesh uh, uh, elastic mesh uh, section here as well and the big um, storage area. This section is built for wet clothing. So inside it, it is a washable waterproof section. Uh, so you can put any wet item that you have inside here and it should be contained uh, within this section. And uh, I believe this is also washable. So you could easily to clean this off if there's a spill or anything that saws the section uh, you can easily clean this off so what I'll do now is um, I'll get a couple of my toiletries and try to pack this out and see how much I can fit into uh, this bag okay so uh, I'm, this is uh, everything uh, I could possibly think of if I'm going to do a travel for you know two weeks uh, a week more than uh, more than a week two weeks or maybe three weeks um, so um, this is you know this is probably what the maximum uh, I would take I like to travel minimum but I bought this for if I'm going on a long holiday and uh, I want to make sure I've got everything I need. So some of these tubs, some of these are empty so because I've not filled them in. These can fit into, I believe these were built to fit into sections like this. So they will completely fit into this section. That is my electric toothbrush. And um, so that is fantastic. That should fit into uh, this section I use, I'm not a, a razor shaver person, so um, I will I, I will use my clippers uh, to shave. Um, you know that's what I use on a daily basis. So this is fantastic. Electric um, toothbrush can fit into this section. You know, so many other stuff can also fit into this section. Let's say, for example, a comb can also fit into this section. This is my clipper. Um, so I will see if I can find a comfortable place for it. So this is probably the maximum I will take when it comes to washing, washing up liquid. Uh, this should also uh, probably comfortably fit inside here as well. Um, okay. And then my clipper, um, I'll put this one on, on top of all this at the end of the day. This is my body spray. This is some sunscreen. This is some cologne. Uh, this is my toothpaste. Um, this is my clipper uh, charger and my clipper. So let's see how this will zip up. So this is about the maximum. I don't think I've ever traveled with this amount of uh, toiletries. Uh, so this is, I've just decided to push it to the maximum and see how this will all fit in. And as you can see, it zips up completely well and um, you know this is this is it so it does fit everything so hopefully uh, this video helps out anyone out there who's looking for a toiletry bag to buy um, this one I got this from Amazon uh, it's from Bag Smart 
um, so it's something good for you to check out um, if this video if you've liked this video please uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and click on the notification bell uh, so that youtube will let you know when next i post a new video thank you very much for watching and uh, have a great day